I'm just going to say one thing. Oh my God. Yesterday was absolutely... I can't... There's no word to explain it. I met Tinsley Strider, um, Ironic, 2020, um, Stacey Solomon, The Wanted, um, and they're all back in my campaign now. Um, the Wanted have already added me on Twitter. They're following me on Twitter already. Um, and I've got in contact with the others. And it was absolutely amazing. Um, me and Anastasia, who's doing Where's Our Vote, also a Battlefront campaigner. Um, we had media and access all area passes. How amazing was that? The O2 London. We were backstage. Eliza Doolittle was playing and we were actually walking underneath the stage. I just, ah, oh, every single feeling you had was just absolutely amazing. Um, since he stride out, I actually found out, isn't, I thought he was like quarter Ghanaian, but he's actually completely Ghanaian. Um, his mum and dad are Ghanaian and he was born in Accra, which is the capital of Ghana. And he lived there until he was about seven or eight years old. So he's got a very strong connection. And he was very enthusiastic about supporting my campaign. Um, so with the Wanted, Ironic 2020, and Stacey Solomon was amazing. She looked so cute in her dress, like a little Barbie doll. Um, and in 2020, I actually asked them if they had a pen. And one of the guys actually found in his pocket a Sharpie pen. So I'll make sure that goes to a child in Ghana when I go over there. Um, and David Bell, who um, is the main guy for the Transformation Trust, he he set set it up. He actually um, he had a park pen in his pocket, which I understand he wouldn't donate, but um, he. <laughs> he said that he was going to send me a box of pens and I have faith in him because he told me a lot about himself if you look at my video with him um, what he's done out in um, different African countries is amazing um, I do need to work on a few things though with my campaign um, I need to work on my confidence in different situations I can be quite shy at times and um, sometimes my mind just goes completely blank, so I need to really work on that, which I'm going to be doing. Um, also, I need to, I should have really practiced before I spoke to them, because sometimes I got a response which I wasn't, I didn't really know what to follow up with, so I had to come up with something in my head. It could have been better, but I mean, it was my first time. Um, <laughs> also... <laughs> I really should have straightened my hair yesterday, but I woke up late and I rushed out the door and I hadn't straightened my hair, so it didn't look so good, but I've learned. <laughs> um, but it was a fantastic day. Um, my next aim is to get Ready 8 on my campaign. I've been tweeting him um, a couple of times today. Um, and I'm still waiting for the rest of the celebs I met yesterday to tweet me back, like Stacey Solomon. Um, also, with my storage option, I've, I'm hoping that I've got some, um, some storage. It's, it's not long term, it's short term. But for now, it will be good because there's a lot of you guys saying that you want to give me some stuff and got it in my room or at a friend's house there's two of my friends I say thank you for storing it um <laughs> yes I'm not paying you though um so yeah it was it was a fantastic day I I got my VIP passes which I'm going to be hanging up on my wall and making a big display of so um oh, it's filled me so much confidence I'm going to it's it's just lovely knowing that these people really do care and they really do want to help and I'm really excited about what's coming and like I said in my um, first video you know I'm not going to give up and I'm just going to say yeah again I'm not giving up and now I've got this back in it's just fantastic right well I'm going to let you go now anyway <laughs> okay see you later bye